All right, we're back at it again. Got the uh, Oregon phone posits. Uh, I believe this was a, wait a minute, hold on. Yeah, this was a quick strike too. Uh, these, like, uh, this was just like on my bucket list. Like I had to have these. Um, I didn't want to pay no crazy price for them. I ended up getting them from SneakerCon from a buddy of mine. Um, that was actually walking around sticker con selling them and a couple other pairs of shoes but uh these were definitely going to be in my possession sometime or another so like i said when sneaker con came to cleveland i made it a point to make sure i was looking for these uh but yeah that uh that hang tag is from uh i got that also from sneaker con um nike nate was there uh, on instagram i believe his name is nike nate 21 um, so Nike Nate, the number two one. Um, I got those from him. Um, but yeah, really dope. Um, I'm sure these are reviewed like heavily on YouTube. I haven't looked to see, but uh, yeah, I just want to give you a quick look at. It. I'm not really gonna go through like a, a whole bunch of detail. I mean, you know, like pretty much the layout of phone posits and you know what's going on with them. But just uh, point out a couple things on here that are special about this, like all the uh, little wings on the side. Um, and all those, the, this entire shoe is pretty much 3M. So when the light hit it, you know, it really reflects. And you can see um, the glitter sole. And that's really what catches a lot of attention on here too, is the glitter on the sole. See the scent logo, the one cent logo for Penny. All right. So then you also have the duck feet and the O for Oregon. And then the tongue, it'll say, I mean the tongue, the uh, the heel tab says Oregon. And then on this side, it says ducks. All right, there you have it. And all that's, that's stitched in. It's not just, you know, like um, embroidered on there. I'm embroidered, uh, but not just like uh, placed on there. Like you would, it would rub off or anything. Um, then on the inside, Hold on one second, let me get the laces off so you can really see it. On the inside, that's the little Oregon Duck mascot. So you can see that. And then also on the tongue. That's him again, right there. All right. So that's pretty much that. Oops. But yeah, but these are crazy. Uh, they're crazy to me. I mean, I don't know, you know, if everybody else loves them or wants them or whatever the case may be, but they are, uh, they were really on my list of things I wanted to have in my collection. Um, I haven't worn them yet. And also I grabbed a uh, pair of socks to match. So I got these socks to match them. So, you know, got the wings like all over it. Now I got these socks from, uh, I bought them online at um, rock'emapparel.com. Um, now, um, they have an Instagram also, and it's, I think it's Rock'em Apparel. Um, and you can do that, but I customize these myself. They have like a thing where you can uh, make up your own socks or, you know, own designs. Not necessarily own designs, you can, they have preset designs and you can make them, um, you can make the shoes. I mean, you can make the socks different colors uh, off their preset designs. So, it was nice. So, I really think these are pretty dope. I think they match up pretty good. So, uh, I haven't worn them yet, but I definitely plan on wearing them sometime soon, especially when the weather really breaks. Uh, yeah, man, that's about it. But these are the Oregon foam posits with the hang tag and the socks so um and these i mean they fit like any other foam they're, they're going to be snug and they're they're going to be as they're going to be snug each time you put them on um unless you wear them frequently because you have to let that foam pot that foam positive material really mold to your foot that's the whole thing about foam posits so if you're not willing to wear them a lot or you're going to wear them um not so frequently like yeah it, it might feel a little uncomfortable every time you go put them on your feet because it's not you're not allowing the time for your, your body heat to heat up the foam posit in order for it to mold to your foot to make a more comfortable fitting um fit so that's something that people just seem to always blow that off um 
but foam foam is something you have to really the foam positive material is something you really have to put time into um, and be persistent on wearing them in order to you know really get the benefit of the comfort of the shoe because it's actually a really comfortable shoe if you give it time and you mold it it's just like you know just breaking it in you have to break it in you can't just put them on today and just act like everything's gonna be a-okay and it, it won't feel that way I promise you it won't but yeah that's it but um thank you for watching just um and people subscribing i appreciate it um uh, rate comment subscribe i mean ask me any questions you want if i got the answer i'll definitely let you know or i'll try to find it for you or or anything follow me on instagram um and see what i post if you have any requests let me know i'll, I'll be more than willing to do it for you if i have the shoe i'll definitely well if i'm posting it it's mine so i can definitely do those reviews but if you have a request for a specific video if i have that shoe um outside of what i post on ig then I'll definitely do a review on it for you. Um, so I'm just trying to bring you guys more content uh, so you can see you know, what's going on. But I appreciate you stopping by, checking me out. And uh, we'll do it again sometime real soon. So talk to you later, guys. Peace.